Damn it, once again, I forgot, I didn't fucking, I, I started the video too soon before I loaded it. Okay, right now I'm in a fucking gunfight that I'm kind of lazily doing. Not lazily, it's just, oh fuck, now I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Okay, here they come. If I can just get some headshots. Nice. Nice. Oh, this is a game changer right here. Damn it. That guy, that, that one guy outsmarted me. But these guys won't. He outsmarted me too. Hey, get the fuck out of my face. I don't know you. Oh, what the fuck was that? What the hell? The fucking building ate me. Was this Monster House? I don't think it is. I would remember because Monster House is one of my favorite fucking movies. And that guy didn't look like Chowder. So, don't stand here? Clearly? Alright. Well, don't stand here. Whoop, missed. Got him. Got him. Is there a timeline? Am I supposed to be fucking leaving or something? Got him. Didn't get him. Got him. All right. Am I supposed to be leaving? Is that what that explosion tells me? God, that guy with a fucking shotgun's gonna wreck me. Um. Hmm. I don't think I'm supposed to leave. Holy shit, what the fuck is that? Oh, it's LaRue! What up, dude? Oh, dude, LaRue, you killed me! On accident! I forgive, I forgive, and I forget! Well, that's- God damn it, I literally... <sighs> Do I want to keep playing? No. So I'm gonna tag this part at the end of the other part. I apologize, whatever. Check that out, I got a new fucking thing. Oh, hold on, there's a cutscene. Um... Shit. I guess I gotta watch this cutscene. And then I'll end the part. Fuck. Damn it! Muddy, you son of a bitch. He probably knocked over my fucking water. You bastard. You adorable looking son of a bitch. With your little face. I'm gonna fucking kill him. Unless this. No, I think this is the end of the chapter. As soon as it actually becomes gameplay. Cool! Crap, now I'm back in the fucking world. Like, the town. I hate the city. I hate the city aspects of this fucking game. Because it's all dirty, and it's hard to see. And you're like, oh man, what the fuck am I looking at? It's like, oh, garbage, man. Ah. Sneak in the bus. Okay, I am going to end it right there. So stay tuned for more. <laughs> Alright, I'm, I'm, I'm here. Sorry, hold on. Let me get situated. I'm gonna get ready for this. I'm here. We're playing. Condemned 2. And I just checked and I have three more chapters after this. One chapter I totally forgot fucking exists. So here we are. And I think... Oh, hold on. Is that camera perfect somehow? Did I somehow fucking get it perfect? Well, now it's not perfect. That, uh... That, like, flappy, like, plastic noise you hear in the background is my cat hitting the fucking blinds to the door. That looks pretty fucking good. Let's tighten my tripod. I need to move it slightly over. Slightly back. I'm gonna call that good. That looks fucking good. Let's just start some shit. Let's do this. Oh, I'm supposed to not kill anyone you don't see me you don't see me apparently the guy right there also didn't hear any of that I'm the sneakiest goddamn drunk bomb ever to fucking exist let's go LaRue I'm gonna get this guy too unless he turns around unless he turns around yeah gotcha 
That's gotcha journalism. Oh, hold on. You can absolutely see my reflection in the fucking video. How... How can I darken that? Okay, hold on. Hold on. I'm thinking... I'm thinking I can use this... Blanket here. Oh, hell yeah. I can totally use this. Yeah. Yeah, here we go. Jesus Christ. Why is it gonna be such a nice sunny fucking day out? Doesn't the world know I'm trying to fucking record? Pieces of shit. Do I want water? No, fuck it. How's that look? Well, it looks better. You can kind of see my shoulder. Whatever. I don't, I don't fucking, I don't fucking care. How do you turn your light on again? Apparently, apparently my flashlight don't work. And that don't work. Hey, Lou, why isn't my flashlight working? <sighs> okay, what am I supposed to do? I'm going here. Oh, right here. So this guy right here is Serial Killer X. The guy who killed the mayor, and I fought him in the first game. Why and I, you kill your uncle? And I, oh yeah, he also killed his uncle. You refused. You're gonna <laughs> I'm right now, um, what am I doing right now? I'm uploading the, uh, uh, Jesus Christ, his face is all fucked up. Oh yeah, he also cut off one of my fingers. But, anyways, I'm also right now currently uploading all the Dead Space videos, because I beat the game. Buddy, can you not touch the blinds? Thank you. Um, so I finished Dead Space. I'm probably going to be able to finish this today if I only have three more chapters to do. If they're short chapters, which I kind of hope they are, um, that would be fucking great. Because, like, what time is it right now? 9.38. My roommate will probably be back at, like, 2. I, I could probably finish this today. We'll see. We'll see if I fuck up a lot and I suck. I will say the lighting in this scene is pretty fucking good. Oh, man. So yesterday I finished watching the movie Shadow... In the Shadow of the Moon. Good fucking movie. Holy shit. Um, it's on Netflix. I highly recommend it. It's really fucking good. It has to do with time travel and detective stuff and everything. It's really fucking good. I very much enjoyed it. And then after that, I watched... Uh, oh, God, there I am. You can see my reflection. You can see my hand. Blake, you're breaking the immersion. Why am I so red? Oh, it's because of that light coming from the red curtains I have. What the fuck just happened? Like, the, the bus exploded? I think Serial Killer X took the bus for a joyride and he fucking crashed it like a jackass. Anyways, let's just... Oh, I do have my flashlight. That wasn't him, though. Who was that? Oh, give me that. Yeah, gumball machine. I'm about to wreck some dude's life. Um... Oh, what the fuck?! Who the fuck are, who, why was that guy just standing there like a freak? But he had a gun, right? I saw that. He had like a sounds pistol. Fuck off, you fucking spray painting graffiti Banksy. And fuck you. I missed. I missed. Fuck off. I missed. There was a gun. I'm gonna find it. I got it. Hey. Why is it a sounds pistol? That's interesting. That guy sure did not want to die. Um, as I was saying though, I watched In the Shadow of the Moon, highly recommend it. And then after that, I watched Shawshank Redemption for the first time ever. For the first time ever, I watched it uh, from the beginning to the end. Normally I always come in like in the middle when Tommy gets shot or uh, the music part. You know, when he like, Plays all the music and everyone's like, ah, get out of the office. And then I watched Bullet Head, which is a movie that's kind of like a Cujo remake. What the fuck? Oh, that guy in the background. Apparently through that. Shut up. Cool, he's dead. Um, so then I watched Shawshank Redemption through and through. And then I watched Bullet Head. Now, Bullet Head is about... 
three crooks, Adrian Brody, John Malkovich, and I want to say Rory McCulkin? McCulkin? Macaulay Culkin's brother, one of them, one of his brothers was in it. Um, they do a botch robbery and they end up in this weird warehouse where in the warehouse a, uh, a like dog fighting champion is living there. Well, okay, hold on, let me explain what happened. So there's this dog fighting champ, right? Like he's the best dog fight fighter ever. Like he just kills all the other dogs. Um, and his name is De Niro, De Niro, like Robert De Niro. But uh, he gets too old. Donat really explains what happens, but he apparently had a fight with two dogs and it was like a draw. And they're like, Jesus. This is really easy. Sorry, bud. Oh, hold on, there's a uh, thingy. Where's the thingy? Somewhere. Oh, oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, I have no ammo. Who fuck that dude up. Um, so they end up in this warehouse where, so anyways, the dog was part of this dog fighting ring thing, but he was a really good fighter. He killed everybody. He fucking just annihilated every fucking person. But then he gets too old and he gets too damaged or whatever. So then his owner, goes to like kill him but the dog says fuck that and the dog survives the botched killing and then kills his owner and then he like takes over the fucking warehouse where all these dogs had to fight look at this asshole get right oh i missed that's awkward oh pool ball oh i fucked him up i really fucked him up damn i missed is this guy just gonna stand here and take it? A favorite type of enemy. The glitched idiot who doesn't know how to fight back. God damn. Give up. Oh, 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 I got too close, I guess. What the fuck was that spin move? Blocked. Boom! Oh. Swing at me. This guy's got maneuvers. And now he's got dead. Ubers. But, um, so of course, you know, botched nonsense leads them to stay in this warehouse, and then the dog chases them around and all this stuff, and then fucking one of the characters is a drug addict, one of the characters breaks all his ribs, and he's like, ah! But it was actually a pretty good movie. It was a lot better than I thought it was gonna be, because I thought it was just gonna be like a Cujo esque remake where the dog just like. Holy fuck, I bet- Oh no, I, I thought I broke his head off of a bowling ball. But, um, it was actually better than I thought it was gonna be, because I thought it was gonna be a Cujo remake-esque movie where this dog is just, like, killing these dudes and chasing them, where it's mostly about character. Like, even the dog has more- Oh shit, I didn't realize I picked up a shotgun. The dog has actually a lot more character. Like, it was actually really good. I- I don't recommend it, though, because if you're a dog lover, there are some scenes that are really fucking upsetting. Where did I come from? That way? So I go this way. Yes? Yeah. This seems right. This seems right. There's no handle on that door, which means I gotta go that fucking way. God damn it. Um... So if you have, like, you know, if you're sensitive to dog murder, I would say don't watch it. What the fuck? Do I have to crawl in there? No, I don't. Okay, so where do I go? Where do I go? We can figure this out together. I, I could have sworn one of those doors opened. All right, Condemned, if you want to be a little bit more... Oh, what's this? This is like... What is this? How do I get into... Oh, wait, are those the bathrooms? No. All right. Um... All righty! Can't... Can't go that way. And this is where I came from. Um... 
All right, well, shit. So now since I'm stuck, I guess I'll just ramble on. So then after I watch Bullethead, what else did I watch? I watched four movies yesterday. Did I list all four movies? No. The fuck else did I watch? What did I watch? I watched In the Shadow of the Moon, Shawshank Redemption, Bullethead, and then, and then, and then, and then, and then, what else did I watch? I thought I watched a fourth movie, but maybe I didn't. Maybe I didn't. I thought I did, but I guess I didn't. What the fuck am I doing? Oh, what? Rosa. This is when? Okay, so it's... So it's Van Horn, Mayor... Oh, wait, what the fuck was the mayor's name? Director Farrell? Magic Man would be unknown. Well, shit, the mayor's name must have been Mars? And Magic Man is... Fuck yeah, that's perfect. The fuck? Oh shit, it's the mayor's head! Oh, and he carried her head here in this bowling ball bag. Was this the Big Lebowski? Who the fuck are you? Hey, fuck you! Wow, that is one tough glass. That just made me think of the scene in uh, Roll the Ball. Man, what the fuck else did I watch yesterday? I swear I watched the fourth movie. Maybe I didn't. It's a female head in a bowling bag. And it's, uh, uh, what else? Owner of the bag is XKX. Bag contents are filled with blood. God damn, I'm just so fucking good at this game. What the fuck else did I watch yesterday? I swear I watched the fourth movie. I can't fucking remember. So, it must not have been that good? Oh, that great. Now I gotta take a picture of this poor sap. Pull out your camera, dipshit. Perfect! That's a perfect fucking photo! Muddy, what else did I watch yesterday? Alright, I'm upset. I can't remember what else I watched yesterday. But whatever. Um, Bullhead was interesting. Boom, get kicked, sucker. In the Shadow of the Moon is way better, though. Alright, am I done? Are we good? Are one of these things gonna open now? Oh, this. This is now opened. Get in there. Oh my god, it's lane six. Oh! That's right, I watched this movie called The Platform! Which is, uh... It's this weird fucking movie where in this prison... It's, everyone lives on like these floors that have a giant hole in the middle and this platform of food comes down from the first level and goes all the way down to level 334. But, um, uh, two by four, no. Um, it's actually interesting because like, so the platform has food on it, right? It's got all the food that you could possibly ever fucking think of. Um, but what happens is the platform starts on, starts on level one and it works its way down. So the higher up on the level, the more food you get. Because everyone, by the time it gets down to like level, you know, 100, there's like no fucking food. And then everyone's a fucking asshole and they like piss on it and they shit on it and they sneeze on it and they, you know, spit on it because they're just fucking assholes. But the whole movie is about one... Whoa, the lights in here are really fucking weird. Um, give me that... I'll get that bowling ball. It's got a better condition. But, um... Get the fuck out of my way, you fucking chair. But it was really fucking interesting. I, I really liked it. It was really fucking weird. Um, and it's a really weird way to look at how people treat other people. Oh, man, this guy was just... He was just homeless. They like, beat his ass. Um... Because, even, because, like, there's parts where they're like, oh, man, we should talk to the people below us. It's like, we don't talk to those below us because they're below us. They're like, well, why don't we try to talk to people above us? It's like, we don't talk to those above us because they're above us and they will ignore us. I'm like, well, what the fuck? But then if you go up, you treat everyone the exact same fucking way? It was, I don't know. It was interesting to me. I enjoyed it. I actually recommend it. I think it was pretty good. Damn. Perfect shot. Hey. 
Who screamed? Oh, fuck. It's that weird fuck. Hey, you fuck. Uh, the first time I played this game, I got stupid fucking lost in this scene. Because, so you're supposed to be like, oh man, what the fuck was that? That was a weird monster. And then you're like, oh, a door? Oh, but I can't go through the door? You're like, oh, that sucks. What's down here? Oh, look, another door. Can't open that. And then you're stuck, right? You're like, man, what the fuck do I go? You open that? Oh, stun gun battery. Oh, health. Oh, man, where the fuck do I go? The first time I... Oh, wait, give me that. That's like a part of the... Fuck you. Fuck you, I'm out. Um, so you're like, oh man, I don't know where the fuck to go. As a little kid, you know, I was like a teenager, didn't know what the fuck to do. So I quit the game multiple times, because I was like, man, maybe I, I missed something, maybe I fucked up. It's right here. It's right fucking here. It's right here. I apparently, when I first played this game, I never, never stood right here. Never got close enough. But if you follow that fucking weird creature, he goes up here. So this is like to show you, I think, to go up. Maybe he goes up here? What am I looking at? That's just like... Goo? Gross. But yeah, I... Whoa, what was that? That was weird. I got sucked into the ceiling. I like the platform. It's a Netflix original. Um, I will say, Netflix originals have some... I mean, Netflix has some really... Good, solid, original movies. Oh, look, a dog! Who's talking? Alright, well, hold on. It's an optional take pictures. I will take some motherfucking pictures. Boom. Beautiful. Oh, this guy's yammering. This looks fucking terrible. Look at his fucking head shake. Sir, can you stop moving so I can have focus on the camera? You know, like, could you just stop being a dick? All right, what's this? This is like a electric boogaloo. It's like an electric chair. Well, it's like a table that like they strap you to. Okay, what else we got going on back here? More wheelchairs. So they wheelchair you into this weird fucking. Well, let's just take a picture of this. That looks good. There you go, Rosa. Hope you enjoy all that weird fucking shit. That looks explosive. Is that a gun? No, it's a liquor, bo liquor, li liquor bottle. Damn. I'll take a picture of the pup. Hey, bud. I was just talking about a movie with you in it. The dog also in Bald Head is really fucking cute. Um, but again, you know, if you're sensitive to stuff, I would say don't watch it because it's not, it's not friendly. It's not nice to dogs. I don't like it, but I wanted to finish the movie because I was, I was in, uh, it intrigued me. If it was just a movie about the dog chasing the three characters and trying to kill them, I probably wouldn't have finished it. But since it was actually like, it showed the dog's life and it showed its perspective and showed why it, you know, became the way it does. And then like, you actually feel something for the dog. It's like, it's actually like a real character, not just like fucking an animal. Cause like, you know, like in some movies we're like, oh man, it's an evil dog movie. It's like, oh, the dog's a demon. The dog has no feelings. The dog is like a, ah, ah. this one's like, no, the dog is like a real fucking thing. I actually really like that. That's not a dog. That's, that's a man. Oh, you know what? I didn't need to take pictures of the torture devices, I guess, in the other room. I guess it has to be separate. Okay, what what does it want me to take a picture of now? Leaving this? Is this is this not? Oh, I see. Okay, my mistake. Somebody wants a whole fucking. Can I kill you? Nope. Sorry, bud. What do you want? Whoa! Ow! Shit! He whacked me. Nice. Uh. Buck. Oh. Buck. Bam. I'll tell you, the first time I played this game as, like, a dipshit child teenager, I did not understand the fucking fighting mechanics in this game. Not saying I understand them now, but I understand them a lot better than I ever fucking did as a kid. 
Alright, dude, I'm sorry. I'm gonna beat you to death with my brass knuckles. Oh, he beat me to death! Okay, my mistake. I thought I was fucking good at this game. Apparently not. Tits. Oh, now I have steel toe boots. I got those for killing the bear? No. I got those for being in the museum? No. I got those for... Something? I got them for something. Oh, damn it. Now I gotta take fucking photos again? Ah, oh, tits. Alright, well, at least now I won't waste time. Hold on, back it, back it up. Get a good fucking photo. That's a good fucking photo. Wait, is this the correct torture device? No, I think it wants a picture of this torture device. Yeah. Idiot. Look at him, he's like going fucking insane in there. I would go insane too, but at the same time, I know he's like a monster because he's got a weird metal mouth. Alright, I'm gonna go this way. No, we don't. You did the same thing last time. You went the wrong way, dipshit. There's a man! Nice fucking maneuver. I need a weapon. Ow! RT! LT! Wambo Cambo! Combo. Sorry, bud, you're dead. Hold on, give me. No, give me. Can I have like a good fucking photo? There we go. Well, at least he has a urinal. But you know, if he has to shit, how the fuck. Oh, what the? Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, 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 hey! Hey! Oh, what? I thought I caught him on fire! Oh, it does catch him on fire! Woo! Get fucking bent, son! I'm gonna stop the part right there.